What's up guys, Holden here at H1 Fitness. Um, today we're going to go after, let me get all this stuff out of the way, go after this, uh, these hip rotators, tensor fascia latte, then we're going to finish it up with the iliacus, okay, so just kind of all this stuff right here, okay, so I have something new that I've been using, it's a shot put. Um, 12 pounder um, doesn't have any give, so it's nice because um, all those muscles just have to give because this is so solid that if you just lay on it, uh, it's pretty intense. So, start here. You guys can see that right? ball right here. Okay, just lay on it. So you can make sure you hold there, find a spot, hold, contract, relax, squeeze your butt. You also do some shearing, so kind of do some sliding forces, kind of move the ball. Okay. And just try and work around all of your butt. Okay. And then come up to that TFL, which is right here. It's that um, cushiony muscle and that muscle is what connects and is an insertion of your IT band so IT band pain um, a lot of it can come not only from the tissues around the knee like your um, lateral hamstring and your uh, lat um, lateral quad but also it can start up at your, at your TFL so we gotta loosen up all that junk And uh, it gets pretty tight, it's pretty hard to stretch. So really the only way is to roll it out, okay? So put the ball down after you get all those rotators, um, glute, mead, max, piriformis, uh, gemellus, all that stuff, okay? Then take your kettlebell. And your iliacus is right, you guys can see this. So your hip bone, it's right there. Your hip bone goes, runs right next to it. Okay, this is what we're gonna do. You're gonna lay on the kettlebell and turn it according to your hip. So, your left side of the kettlebell look like this a little bit. And just like that, you're gonna lay on it. And get my shirt out of the way. Make sure you um, really relax here. Okay. Okay. Um, a lot of people say they might not feel that much because you really need to relax in that position. Very, very important. Um, iliacus connects to your hip and spine. Involves in that hip flexion. Okay, so um, you gotta stretch that out, get that mobilized. So I just think this whole hip complex, you know, right here and all this area right here, okay? Loosen that up. It's very important, it plays a big part how you can create posture torque through your um, body and your feet. Um, so keep those hips nice and loose. So there you go, guys. Hip complex. See ya.